Hello everybody and welcome to my new episode and today I am going to show you to unbox this uh, PCI wireless adapter and uh, show you how to install it onto your computer. Now, um, so this is the box. In the box it comes with a quick installation guide um, it also comes with uh, the Windows 8 installation guide because I guess that's probably different but I'm not gonna be covering that because I don't have Windows 8 I have Windows 7 here is the resource CD the drivers and everything the utility if you really want the utility but I'll show you that later okay here is the wireless PCI Express adapter itself in the anti-static bag because yeah it has to be stored in this anti-static bag yeah so first of all turn off your computer then unplug all of your USB devices PS2 or any other display connectors everything everything that's plugged into the back of your computer now um, here we are. Put your case on its back. Uh, what is it called? Anyway, so unscrew it to open it up. Also, if you bought this computer somewhere already uh, made, you should probably hand it to them to install it for you, because uh, you may lose you may lose your warranty if you do this yourself. Just uh, watch. Is there on back any stickers that will show, that will indicate that you opened your the, this computer? Now, uh, here is the my old uh, PCI adapter wireless. So I'm gonna remove that because I don't need that anymore. This this old one. Ground yourself. Uh, hold your hand on your your case for a few minutes. Now here is the old PCI adapter. I'm gonna remove the antenna first, so it's easier for us to uh, remove the old adapter. You probably may not have to remove an old adapter, but uh, in this case I'm installing another wireless adapter, so I am gonna have to remove it. Uh, why would you have to two wireless adapters at the same time that yeah okay so I don't know what is your case but mine unscrews like this so when you unscrew this you have access to all uh, devices that are in PCI slots okay now remove your old PCI adapter or don't if you don't have an old PCI adapter also, you don't have to remove it it's, if it's not a wireless adapter. Okay. Now, get it out. And here we are. Just pack it up into your old antistatic bag so doesn't uh, break. Yeah. So you have it if, if this new one gets broken. Yeah, so you don't have to buy a new one. Um, and so here it is. Um, yeah, I forgot one thing. You will also have to remove your metal metal plate that uh, plate for the. space for the PCI Express adapter so here that is where we are gonna plug in our adapter and if you or only this is a PCI Express adapter if you have a PCI adapter then you should uh, plug it into, into the lower one uh, you could see by those connectors the PCI adapter is a bit larger. This one is r smaller version of PCI. 
adapter. So it's called PC Express. That makes no logic, but okay. Um, so remove this. So we have a place for your uh, PC Express adapter. And there we are. Now put your adapter into its place like this. Just make sure everything is lined up so you don't damage your motherboard or anything else like that. So uh, there it is. Now screw the plate back like it was before. So yeah, it doesn't come off. And screw it in. Tighten it up nicely. Then after that, put your screw in your antenna. Screw it at the top, so yeah. Position it well, however you want. So it doesn't come in the way of cables. Now put your uh, case uh, closer back, uh, whatever it is, it is called the metal for closing the case. Okay, let's call it like that. And yeah, screw it in nicely. And uh, plug your cables back in. So here we are, I'm going to show you how to install it on your computer. Now uh, when you put in your uh, CD, you're going to get this menu. So choose your model of your adapter and uh, click on install. Now uh, here it is, I'm going to install it so when it comes, yeah, it it probably is gonna be slow a bit so it loads up resources and as you see um, I, I am not able to connect to internet right now in the bottom right corner corner and uh, here it is click next it's probably gonna take a while and Here it is, this will pop up and uh, you could install the utility too but for my uses I'm gonna install only the driver, I don't need the utility, uh, I read something bad about utility too. So yeah, I won't install it, I don't need it, I didn't install it with the old adapter either. And uh, here it is, uh, you should be able to connect to your wireless uh, network now. Here it is, enter your security key. Oh, whoops. And it's connected. I did not have any problems with my Wi-Fi uh, adapter. Uh, I have tested it a few days and no problems with it. So, yeah, thank you for watching this and goodbye.